G'day, g'day, YouTube. Necrocar Sexual Eye here with the next chapter in Jack to the Future. I think this is session two, part one. But before that, I want to get a couple things out of the way first. Most of all, I want to give a shout out to Eremiah. Sorry if I butchered that name. Uh, in my in one of my other Jack to the Future videos, they pointed out a way to help solve a problem I was having with the audio in which the game crashed due to missing uh, background music. And I've managed to fix it out. I mean, I mean, I can't wait today. I managed to fix it up, everything's working, so thanks. That's sort of why I'm not digging around with trying to record and release this next part. Just as a sign of gratitude, I'll try to not wait so long between episodes. But also, it, of time recording, it is the 17th of September. And I just want to announce that in October, I'm going to be starting two new um, uh, series for the channel. I'm going to be starting Necro Reads, which is just me reading books. Um, I'm going to start with a book of paranormal stories, which I remember reading when I was a young kid. Uh, somewhere in my mess of a bedroom, so I'll dig it up eventually. And also, I want to do a thing called Necro's Necronomicon, which is a Halloween season specific series in which I will have a look at the history of paranormal monsters and stuff like that, things of the occult. And seeing how it has affected modern culture. So it's sort of like um, top 10 scary urban legends and monsters videos. And it's going to focus on one subject at a time and go into full detail. Uh, and to get started, I think my first video will be about vampires because that's a very easy subject to dissect. Then maybe I'll do some more normal stuff like werewolves and zombies and other stuff like that. Ghosts. I'll make five videos of that for October. I'll actually pre-record them uh, towards the end of this month. And then I'll record several episodes of Necro Reads, the book I was talking about. And then, I'm not sure what I want to do for Halloween this year, but, yeah, I still need to think about that. Because there are some horror games that I could play, I'm still trying to figure out how to set up my Xbox 360 with my capture card, and so I'd like to play a game. I could also finish my Silent Hill run from last year trying to complete the game on hard difficulty. If anybody hasn't seen that or they've forgotten, on the very last video of that, I chickened out because I got killed by the monsters in the school. And yeah, I was just whinging. It wasn't exactly a good time for me at that point, but I did say I'd get around to that eventually and I think this Halloween coming up is good. I will also want to try and resume my Constantine playthrough eventually. The only reason why that got put on hiatus is because uh, I think the last part, or the part after that, that I released, it was just after Halloween. And anyway, we sort of had to get ready to move house. Drop it. Mm, so that got put off. And then 
my sister currently has control of PlayStation 2. Just sitting there in the bedroom gathering dust. And oh, I already just took her bloody Xbox off her, so I don't really want to be asking for a PlayStation back anytime soon. Although she does play it every once in a blue moon, just so she can play Spyro or Crash Bandicoot or an old Resident Evil game. But still, it's not very often. She's been playing uh, the new South Park Fractured Butthole DLC lately, and she's been getting into Until Dawn again. Now, enough about her. Uh, I think now would be a good time to jump into the video. Perfect time there. I just need to make sure the keys are working. Because yeah, the cancel key does not seem to work when I've got numpad enabled. I just need to find myself I'll this one. Okay, these are the two save files from when I was doing just my own beta test run at the game, make sure it was all working. Then this file I was using to test the audio debug. I put the very easy difficulty on and just ran past every monster I could so I can get up to the point where I knew the game crashed. Anyway, let's see. Let's bring myself up to speed with what everybody's got going on. Okay, we've got a good ish amount of healing items. I'm just going to turn up my iPod. Got to make sure not to use that accidentally because that might wreck me chances of getting to the easter eggs. Uh, got no spare equipment or key items. Timber from knives. I am an old man, my teeth are old, my limbs are grey, and I don't really have much good for sale. I'm buying a couple of Jameson's 80 proof might be a good idea. Um, although, I'll wait until much later in the game before I start buying those, because they are like a thousand. Whereas, my party members only have like h half the maximum HP that harps recover so I'll buy I can max them out and then I'll sell me off me Guinnesses I'll hang on to these One man and another man, a fantasy world. What does it all mean? And I might as well start wrecking some monsters. Again, I'm going to keep their dialogue in, then just skip the battles. But because I was so caught up with the um, the music references in the last video, I didn't end up saying half the dialogue, and I'm sorry for that. So I'm, so, I'm just going to say, I am shocked that that video has not been blocked yet. Still fully functional, it's not banned in any countries, despite having fucking Marilyn Manson in it. <laughs> I can't believe my luck. Especially after my first video getting banned and taken down. Little tip, do not play Avenged Sevenfolds and all things will end in your video. You will get taken down. <laughs> anyway. Get ready for rock. Climbing, Jack. Rock climbing. Okay, I'm supposed to care about climbing rocks. 
Rock climbing, Jack. Rock climbing. Yeah, I don't really care about rock climbing. Rock climbing, Ken. Rock climbing. <laughs> Dumbass. Would you like a drink? Um, sure. Why not? Oh, yuck. This shit tastes like rocket fuel. It is. <laughs> the m m master won't l l l like this. Well, that's just too bad then. Go on, go get it. One thing I just realised too, I've got fuck all space on my computer. And I don't think recording extra shit is going to go down well with it. So after this battle, I'm just going to quickly delete any excess shit from previous recordings. You know, before everything goes tits up. Okay. Jump cut to the next screen. <laughs> okay, so that should be sorted. Puma? 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 What are you looking for? Uh, sorry, didn't see you there. Fear not, or fear a lot. You're the guy I was supposed to KOS. Dancing at the party. The Nazi party. That's a bit much. The ma master already has so many wives. He can't ha have yet you. I I what what you you he can't have uh, no. This place is getting too strange. Getting. <laughs> hey there, you dropped something. It's a plot device. It's very flimsy, so be careful. Sorry, I think I stepped in it. <laughs> <laughs> I am Mount Svengale. You will do as I say. How about no? How can a mountain tell you what to do when it has giant psychic eyeball monsters on it? Ah, yes, I can see how that might work. <laughs> Felix is now level 18. Fruity faux pas has been learned. Nice. The tree was... <laughs> the tree just went... Pssst. Talk to the tree. I am the talking tree. You must do what I say. Um, bring me some fresh water. Yeah, I'm just going to say right here, I have no idea what to do with this tree. I've looked all over for a way to do it in case it was like a side quest or something. It's probably just a joke, though. Tibby! Who? Tibby! Who the fuck is Tibby? I don't know, I was joining. <laughs> oh, fucking typo. Here, look at this. <laughs> fuck, I'm not good with words today. Look at this Rorschach test. Um, I see a lot of ink and stuff, like split on the paper. Yeah, ink. Hmm. Puts on glasses and pees at pews. That means you're a sexual predator. <laughs> I am too stupid for my own good. Level 20, hash hash strike learn. Them bosses are not gonna stand a chance. Watch out for snakes. Who said that? Who said what? You didn't hear that? Um, nope. Weird. Mr. B, immigrant. Eek. Oi! Twat face! Hi, Jack old pal. How you been? Oh yeah, the quest. Glad you made it through, okay? Things do get harder, but you're a top boss. You know how to win. So... Okay, look what the bloody fuck is going on here. What? Oh, like the magic? That's as good as a starting spot as any? Yeah. Okay. The magic. Shut up, Felix. Men are having a chat here. Alright. You ever play D&D? &D? 
<coughs> I know a bit about it. I ain't that kind of geek, though. Okay, look. A big part of that game is how belief powers the gods. People stop believing in them, then they stop being gods. Well, there's truth to that. And you big YouTubers have had an awful lot of people believing in ya. What? You trying to say we're all gods? Like a boss! <laughs> Not quite, but it did give you a certain... something. The community aspect of it made it stronger than other celebs ever had it before, and you passed it on. After <coughs> after the collapse? I'll tell you about that another time. Magic was rediscovered, and the lines of power were traced back to all of you. So, I needed a champion, I had an artifact I could use to go back in time, so I used it. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, Japanese. So, now we're going to save your world and stuff. Now it's about the size of it. Well, the kingdom. The Empress isn't a woman out for world domination. She's just a lazy, greedy bitch. Like my sister. But one that could cause a lot of suffering. She's got the whole kingdom by its short hairs and she's made deals with all sorts of horrible monsters, mercenaries and demons. She might not want to rule the world. But any number of them might as well use a newfound influence to take a stab at it. That's why I needed a champion. So I gotta take off again. You know how it is. I gotta drag out the backstory in between you killing shit, otherwise I'd run out of things to say. Oh, and I had time to bring another buddy of yours to help. He's upstairs. Ciao, fairly well, and may you never find yourself drowning in a cask of piss. Right. Onward ho! Ah, why do you have to be so mean? <laughs> I'm actually really getting into the voice acting for this game. I thought it'd be absolutely shit at it. Considering. Why are all the dogs at dog shows really nice dogs? You never see a pit bull with a ribbon around his head going, You say one fucking word. Yeah, and people say to me, You know what they say? They say, Lee, you should take up golf. It's good for you. You know what I say to that? Fuck off. Oh, look who it is, Ed. It's Wizard Boy. Slay any dragons lately? Hmm? No, Dara. I haven't slain any dragons. Fick it. I thought you might be able to help me get past the ficker. I go down, up, down, left, right, up, crouch, 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 jump and touch, jump and touch. And the ficker just keeps killing me, Aris. Takes all the crack out of the game. This gent tried to pick a fight with me the other day. He said... If you look up stupid in the dictionary, it has a picture of your face. I said, yeah. Well, I'm not the one who had to look up stupid in the dictionary. And, oh yeah, mine doesn't have fucking pictures in it either. Good one, Ed. These yanks don't know what they'd be missing, not knowing like we do. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the Alright, let's see what we've got here. Got some good equipment available. I'm not going to look at all these bloody background things, that's just going to take forever. Don't look them in the eyes. These ones are always the same. Pretty sure. People always want to know, what can a wine go with what? Well, I say you can a wine you like. Now you add a little bit of wine to this sauce. It's I like to add a lot through. Wow, whew, that's just right. Now that a fine part of gumbo. I guarantee. I have no idea what a fucking accent that was. Oh, it's you. Stop being condescending. I'm not being condescending. I'm too busy thinking about far, far, far more important things you wouldn't understand. Burned. I love Jimmy Carr. What are you doing listening to that cunt for? So I can use heckle put down like this. If you had a hard time being understood, you might have a speech impediment. Or you might just be from the Republic of Ireland. Damn! <laughs> Whoa! Please tell me you're my new friend that's going to help me on my quest. What? No, sorry. What quest? Are you a famous adventurer? Or be any damn thing you want. <laughs> Fucking smooth, Jack. You're cute, but I don't know anything about a quest. Sorry. Are you sure? 
No secret special fighting skills in the magic. Nope, I'm a boogie bard. Come again? I teach dancing. I think it's time you found who you're looking for now, don't you think so? I'm quite happy just to stay here with you. The quest can go to hell. Well, you wouldn't be much of an adventurer if you did that. Go on, scoot. <laughs> the developer in this game has got a weird fucking sense of humour. Like I'm any better, but still. Ah, she's like a fine old lady that just had a dip in the pool. Um, okay. Are you having that? Am I having what? Are you having that? What's that? I don't understand what is happening. Ah, uh, jacket boy, you don't need to be understanding nothing. You just have to get your plate of cabbage and go of it. Are you having that? Okay, sure. Subscribe, 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 and please let me know. Are you having that? What do you want, Scruff? Hey, no need for that. I'm looking for a friend that's supposed to help me with a quest. Don't know nothing about that, Scruff. Okay, what do you do then? Really rather not say, Scruff. Why not? I'm a beef enchanter. Don't say a word, just leave. Jack! Look! Mark! Mark! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, you owe me a coke! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, you owe me a coke! Whoa, you guys are here too? I thought this was another fan game for me. Why doesn't anyone ever make fan games for me? Uh, because you made your own game, Felix? Glares the putes. Sorry, Mark. This is one of mine. Back to the line, lad. You can watch our asses. Looks at the audience and shakes his head. Well, can you at least tell me what's going on? Right. First... A weird wizard guy showed up in my room. Then I was brought to this crazy ass place. Some princess needs saving. YouTubers have magic pals. It's a fucking fan game, Mark. What the fuck do you think is going on? Okay, okay. No need to get so angry. Tap it to moon into you. Hi! <laughs> Okay, I think I may be going mad. Huh, it's nearly nine o'clock already. My friend's getting a bit scratchy as well. I think I might go for a patented Jacksepticeye, let's drag out the video's playtime, Hebrick. And yes, I am going to leave it all in.